Hey, it's Chase Forrester here from Resync Media, and we are looking today at Mermaid. So Mermaid is a tool that is JavaScript-based, and basically it allows you to get your client's requirements for a complex app or website or even software that you're building, and it allows you to understand it a little bit better with a mapped guide. Can't stress enough how much this has helped me in the past especially for how fast and operative it is in regards to you know figuring things out that you perhaps wouldn't using a human analog brain so uh, let's get started okay so firstly uh you know what we want to do is my client has an app this is the app here this is his app that he's made over a short period of like a few weeks and what I want to do is I want to figure out like his requirements. So I've sent him up follow up questions about it as he needs a CRM. CRM basically controls the app from the outside. So we have one of those as well. And it controls the app on Google Play and the app. So that is a complex app. So I've sent him these follow up requirements. And now what I do is I copy and paste his answers, which are listed in red here. And I put it in the chat GPT. And as we can see here, it's given me a code. So we've post, posted that code in. So what we do is we go to live editor and we've plopped that code in and it's given us this beautiful uh, diagram here, which you know shows us everything that the app does, you know, which, which saves a lot of time, you know, saves a lot of time. And then what we want to do is we want to enhance the diagram a little bit further and we want to chuck it into a uh, a document so like you know so the, there's a thing here called the sorry, the playground and this is the playground here where you get to make it more personal like you know like instead of having like in this one it says admin you know we can make it into you know just you know which is my client's name and then just put like admin, and it makes it a little bit more personal now once this is all done you know what you want to do is you want to get the SVG link, you know, and then just kind of paste it up here. And then it'll show the actual image rendered from what we've just made with the update. And we can just copy and paste this, save it, save it any way you want. And then, you know, we can put it back into a Canva file. So I, in order to do this, I need to sign up to Canva, but uh, it doesn't really matter. You know, like we can make one here if we want. And uh, we can put that data flow diagram in here, you know, and then he can see it. Or we can actually upload it, you know, which I need to sign up the can before, but it doesn't matter. You can now update a personalized data flow diagram and make it a lot easier. Take note that Canva does make a whole bunch of, you know, like things that make it a lot easier, you know, like for UI. So you can do that. As you can see here, there's a whole bunch of app UIs that you can use. But the most important thing is to do is to use a data flow diagram because it will help you communicate with your client better. I hope that helps guys. Thanks for choosing Resync Media and we'll talk soon.